The City of Palm Springs Historic Site Preservation Board is hosting its ninth annual symposium. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price went to the event and learned how the board plans to raise up the next generation of preservationists. Preservation is really about recognizing those parts of our history, both architecturally, culturally, and in terms of significant persons who have made a difference in the, in the development of Palm Springs. Ken Lyon is completing his last year as the city's historic preservation officer by hosting hundreds for the annual symposium. He says one of the goals of the event is to dismiss myths about modifications of historical buildings in the area. The biggest myth is that you can't do anything with a historic building and that couldn't be farther from the truth. What's really important for the public to know is that these buildings are live, working, changing buildings. Members of the board say between the two days, 900 people have already registered for the symposium, and they hope to bring up the next generation of preservationists. So, like, I just decided just to make it because it was when it got shut down, it was it broke in my heart, and then so I decided to just make it. Alexia Jimenez is part of the Building Education Architectural Models Program. She made a recreation of Robertson's department store that closed down in the 80s. I'm more like the person that's like into accessories and um, decoration and Louis Vuittons. <laughs> um, I, I'm like into fashion basically. Models were handcrafted by students from across the valley. It's the Architecture and Design Center, Palm Springs, and um, the, uh, the architect was E. Stuart Williams, and I liked the building because of like, the landscape. I really liked how it looked. I want them to know that like, the buildings and nowadays, they don't have to be shut down. They could just rebuild them and show what they are. In Palm Springs, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3.